In the studio, David suggests a drink before we start. Get us in the Friday mood. It's a beer for him and a woo-woo for me. Ready for something new? He asks. How about we do each other's portraits? We can give them to your mum for her birthday. I'm no good at portraits. I'd rather not paint him at all than risk offending David with a poor likeness. He's not going to take no for an answer. Princess, I wish I'd had half your talent at 14. Just remember to start with the bone structure, at least for the face. If you're looking at the torso, get the contours of the muscles as well. He strips off his shirt. Take a photo and I'll show you. I snap five or six images as he stands, thumbs in jeans pockets against a white background. He's been to Thailand again and still has the ghost of a tan. The photographs look amazing, which only increases the pressure on me. David checks them over and selects one. That'll do. The least worst, but still reminiscent of a gay calendar. I blush. Emily, I assure you, I am not gay. Your mother has definitely no beard. He prints the image in his office, then tacks it to the top of my easel with masking tape. Right, when you're ready, we'll sketch the outline. I'll guide your hand, okay? Okay. It still seems a daunting task. David flashes a reassuring smile, then sets up his own equipment. I finish my drink before collecting a large primed canvas, brushes, paints, thinners and pen. Stealing a glance at him, I decide on a cream background, almost off-white. It will set off his tan. I'm ready, I tell him. Great. Hold that paint pen. His arm, warm and muscular, rests on mine as he grips my hand. The sensation of closeness sends a shiver surging through me, despite the warmth. Steady. His other hand clutches my waist as we begin with a rough outline. Head, neck, torso, arms and hands. With a few deft strokes, David adds detail. Firm jaw, slicked hair, rippling muscles. Think you can do it by yourself now? He asks. I'll try. The style is yours, though. It will be 100% yours once it's done, I promise. You're too nervous, princess. Have another tinny. <laughs>